This is for the every mom and every dad driver out there. Today I'm going to show you how to install a Kiko KeyFit infant car seat. This is a two-piece item, a base and a car seat, and we're going to use this 2018 Honda Fit Sport to see how it fits. There are a couple of ways to secure the base of the car seat. You can use the lap belt, the lap shoulder belt, or the latches themselves. Now we can use the lap shoulder belt here. We're going to put it in between here and it's going to come out there and then we'll just put it into the seat belt buckle. Now it is attached. That's if you don't have latches available for you in your car. It's not the best that you want, but it will keep the car's base secure. I'm going to take it out and do my favorite way. And with new cars like the Honda Fit we have here, I'm going to use the latch system. So these latches right here will go into these little slots and you'll see a little button here with a car seat icon on it. All I'm going to do is put it in there where it snaps. You hear the little snap. Same thing on this side. Snapped. Now we're going to pull this strap here to tighten it, but you can only get it so tight. So it's still pretty wiggly right here in the base. So I'm going to get inside the car, use my weight, press forward and pull the latch at the same time, the strap, and see how tight I can get it while I'm pushing forward and pulling the strap to me. Now it's a little bit tighter, but not as tight as I want it to be. So I'm going to actually use my foot. Seems kind of crazy, but now I'm going to pull and push. Now look how secure that is. That is how secure you want it. Very little wiggle room to left and right. Now take your car seat, rear facing, it snaps in perfectly, and that's it. And to release it, you'll see an orange tab back here. Lift, and out it comes. Again, snaps in and pulls out. You'll all just still notice that they have a level and they want the bubble to be in the center here to know that the base is level and mine is perfectly in the center where it should be. Now to release it, very simple, you know, pull and lift this to release, bring some slack into it, press your buttons in on both sides, and now you can place it in another car. Just that easy. I sure hope you found that helpful. I'll put more information about this product in a link below this video. Until next time, I'm Dave Erickson. Thanks very much for watching. Have a great one. Drive safe. Adios. Oh.